Okay, so this is interesting. Uh, I was just looking at that uh, quick little live play that I just ran through on. A couple of things that struck me that I, I made uh, potential errors on. Um, let's see, first off, with ground support, it's, we did that mostly correct when it came to aircraft being added into a, an attack. The way that works is you bring the air units on that you wish to participate in that uh, ground support effort. They are attacked by flak, by each individual flak unit, which we did do. There may have been one other unit that we could have used because some of these divisions have a range of three. Uh, so anyway, you roll for those <coughs> and the resulting units that are left are then added to the defensive value of the, the unit. Now what's interesting on the attack side, if I had had any air available to uh, support that attack, which I really don't in the central front or the northern uh, section of the map either, uh, pretty unsuccessful uh, in that regard. Um, lots of ums today too, that means I don't know what I'm doing. The offensive player, the active friendly phase player can use uh, flak suppression, he can attempt to suppress air defenses around the units that he wants to provide the ground support for for an attack. But you can't do that correspondingly for the defender. So that's an interesting little nuance to take into consideration. You're really going to want to get those A-10 equivalent ground support units in. Uh, they're going to have to fly through some pretty tough flak as we just saw. We had one unit take a, take a damage. Uh, what I could have also done, potentially, uh, the artillery has a range of two, so that could have been, been used in both offense and defense, and we did use it in some of the offense, but in defense it has to be adjacent to the defender to be used, and I don't believe I had a unit adjacent, I may have, I may have had that American artillery adjacent across the river, and he could have thrown his, his uh, artillery value into the mix. I would have had to spend some ammo points for it, but that might have made a difference in the game in terms of bringing the what brought the odds up to eight, which would have been a two to one, moving that to a four to one, and then die roll mods and stuff like that. So, you know, we might redo that little section of the gameplay and uh, see what the results look like with the with by using that artillery. I'm not sure if I want to do that or not. The other thing I could also do is look at, uh, could have looked at trying to bring choppers into the defensive metrics there. But the air, yeah, that flak is pretty tough with the, with the Soviets, so I'm not sure that that's available as well. So I think I'm just gonna append this to, this video to that uh, live play post, and then you guys can see that, and I'll put it up on YouTube at some point later on. So. Thanks for checking in. Appreciate you guys uh, watching, uh, just uh, watching the rest of that today. It was awesome. Thanks.